When you pray for blessing and you do live by negligence, you are a tired fellow serving God with slackness, the devil will come and challenge your prayer and tell you you cannot be blessed, you cannot prosper because it is written, cast is whoever serves God with negligence. Sometimes uh, believers try to put all the burden on their pastor, believing that it's the pastor who is at fault. The pastor is not at fault. The pastor is just a coach. The pastor will tell you what he gets, what he receives from God. He comes and tells you, that says the Lord. Now, what you do with what you receive, decide what you become in the kingdom of God. Okay, there is no way Maybe the pastor can go and tell God, oh, you know, God, uh, I want you to change your constitution, change your word. God cannot change his word. The Bible says as long as the heaven remains and the earth remains, the word of God stands forever. Whatever God says shall come to pass. It stands. Born as you feel. So you reach some places where even your pastor cannot, cannot help you. Because it is the word of God. You obey it, you see the glory of God. You don't obey it, you don't see the glory of God. People of God are called to the zeal of God. Have the zeal of God. Think about God during the week. Think about him on Monday. Think about God on Tuesday. Think about God on Wednesday. Every day. Not just when you're about to sleep, you say, God, I thank you for the day. Uh -uh, think about him. What were you doing during the day? How many minutes have you given to him during the day in 24 hours? Some will not even give 10 minutes in their prayer. And yet you are given 24 hours. What's the 10% of 24 hours? So you see that you have not given God not even a 1% of the 24 hours given to you. And then you say, okay, God has changed. God has not changed. God is still God. You see, the same God. Jesus died at the cross. If you don't believe in that death, if you do not apply the things pertaining to that death in order to see the result, you get nothing. Remember, it's not about having the medication in your pocket. It's about what you do with that medication. If you drink it, it helps you. No, it cannot help you. 